No, no, I think, I, I really think you should come from the BCAT. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come to BCAT, come on. I'm Kyle Everett, uh, I'm 16. I came to BCAT because I wanted to learn a skill. I joined the 3D printing class. I really liked the atmosphere and the people around. It was just such a great place to just be with people, especially in a time where you really couldn't be with people during the pandemic. Yeah, it's just a really great environment. And Hello, my name is Kendra Work, and I have come to be a cat to hold my skills in art and to express myself more. And during my time here at BCAT, I have really opened up to people. I talked to many people that I don't think I would have. And when I came here, um, there was a lot of help and support from the teachers and my friends here that I had made. And the snacks are good, because I'm a fat kid, so I love the snacks here. Um, Everybody just so helpful and general inclined here, and that's what I wanted, and they delivered. <laughs> okay, I kept coming back because it was just a very good experience for me, and I wanted to keep I wanted to keep it up throughout high school. And now that I'm graduating, I'm really gonna miss this place. Like, like if you really got something you like to do, like BCAT's really the place to do it. You know what I'm saying? Like, uh, if you like to draw, there's an art class. If you like technology, there's computers everywhere. You know? <laughs> Hello, my name is Dominique. Um, I'm a former student of BCAT. Um, I started coming to BCAT uh, my freshman year of high school. Uh, why I stayed, it helped me a lot do, during a depressing time of my life and just being here and the people is very amazing. Um, I started taking digital arts uh, and photography and it was something I really love and I still do. Now. I graduated high school and I am now going to college for film. I believe BCAT should be here because if it wasn't for BCAT, I don't know what, what I would be doing right now. Um, it was very helpful for me through all those times. Hello, I am Dr. Kamala Foes and I'm the youth director of BCAT. We are very proud of our youth and all that they accomplished in 2021. We are working very hard to keep in-person programming to our students in the community. Over the past year, we have not only continued to serve, but we have grown our program. We have been able to offer college accredited course by Villa Marie College and professional certification for 3D printing. We also added the only free coding class in Buffalo. We are very proud of our youth and all that they have done in the community, such as the mural that they completed at Horizon, as well as Goodwill in Erie County. We are looking forward to the collaborations that we have coming up in 2022. I'm Marie Bertola. I'm the pharmacy technician instructor here at Buffalo Center for Arts and Technology. This year we've done a lot of important work. The allied health field is growing by leaps and bounds and we are training pharmacy technicians to step into jobs. We have improved the number of students taking and passing the certification exam. This is even more important than ever since there is a new profession in New York State of registered pharmacy technician, which was just started in 2021. And in order to be eligible to become registered, the technician would have to be certified. We have also created some new relationships with CVS and Neighborhood Health Center, along with fostering our other relationships for internship sites for our students. This gives them practical experience to get their feet wet in the field and, and use all of the information that they have learned in the classroom. Most of our students are looking to transition out of just a job into a career and we are there to provide support services for them as they make this journey. It was very healthy for me too, you know. Yeah. A lot. You should yeah. do that. For real, for real. I know. I know.